Hey guys, welcome to my channel. On today's video, I am going to show you what's in my mini bag maximalist edition. This is the bag that I use whenever I go outside for less than two hours. Anything longer than that, I would be in my big bag full of everything that I need. <laughs> and um, this still has a lot of things in it, but not as much as my regular big bag of wonders, as my nieces call it. I got this bag in Shein for 308 Philippine pesos. That would be around $5.42. I use this whenever we go grocery shopping or anything that doesn't require a lot of time. Um, and these are the measurements in centimeters and in inches. Also, sorry if I sound a little weird. Um, I have asthma and so my voice is a little bit shaky, but yeah. Hopefully we still like this video. I'd like to know your thoughts on this size of bag and if you have one. Okay, so first up, my mini clip. I have a clip on every bag that I have, just so whenever I'm ready to go, there's always something that would keep my hair in place. Next up is my umbrella. This is a mini umbrella that can be folded like I think three times. Um, umbrellas are very important when you live in a tropical country. I live in the Philippines and it's always always very hot here. If it's not hot, it's raining. So yes, definitely very important to have in your bag. Next up is my phone. So I usually put my S22 Ultra there, but as of the moment, I'm using it to film. So I have my S20 Ultra. Always very important to have your phone with you anywhere and everywhere in case of emergency or of any form that you need like communication. Everybody has their phone with them all the time nowadays. So yeah, the phone is a little dirty. <laughs> it has a lot of smudges. This isn't supposed to be the vlog that I was gonna do today, but everything that I ordered didn't arrive on time. So it's gonna be on for next week. Next one is this comb that has been with me for centuries now. <laughs> Not exactly centuries, but this has been with me for a very long time. Um, this has been with me on the first country that I visited way back in 2007 and it's still with me and it's already 2022 so you can already imagine how old this comb is and I refuse to let it go. Um, I bought this for 8 pesos a while back. I think if you watched my maximalist what's in your bag, this is on there too. It's gonna stay there until it breaks but it hasn't. It's very discolored and I love it very much. Next one in the bag is this Skull Candy Indie Evo True Wireless Earbuds. That's a very long name. Um, I got it from Shopee. This is a store. I'll put in the screenshot on the screen. And it was 5,290 Philippine pesos. So that would be around $93.10 in USD. If you're interested, um, the store gave me the wrong color. I ordered the green one, but they sent in the black one. They were very nice and said that I could return it, but I didn't have the energy to go out and mail it back. I also don't have the patience to wait another week for it to be sent back to me, so I just accepted it. Oh, I also got 10% off on this one. Very good quality. The noise cancelling feature is great, at least for me. I literally can't hear anything when I put these on. Great to use when you are flying too. Helps with my anxiety. Next one is this little black mini fan. Again, I live in a tropical country. Everything is just like hot and humid here. So I have this with me in every bag. Just a mini fan. Got this in mini Sue for I think 300 pesos if you're interested. Next one is my wallet, where I put everything. <laughs> There's tons of papers on there, aside from IDs, so that's why it's so fat. I probably need to clean that up, but not yet. <laughs> Next is wipes. 
this mini mini wipes that I got from a local grocery store. A mini one for my mini bag. Next one is this liquid sanitizer. We need it, I need it, I need it everywhere. It's almost empty. I need to reveal that. Yeah. This mini lip balm from Vaseline. Because dry lips, who is she? This is a closer look in case you wanted to get it. Next one is my favorite item in this bag. My white flower, my savior. <laughs> I use this for everything, for anxiety, whenever I get anxious. I smell it. It's a very good, it's like an essential oil, but you can also use it for a lot of other things. If you're not familiar with it, this is very famous here in the Philippines and all the other Asian countries. If you're not feeling well, you just get some of it, put it on your body, your body, buddy. Put it on your body and you know sometimes it makes you feel better and when it doesn't then you have something <laughs> this is a staple in every bag i own each and every one of them has one of these just in case i forget to like transfer from one bag to another this is the largest size available that i could buy 20 ml if there's a bigger size and you know where i can get it let me know and i will get it if there's like a 50 ml one <laughs> Let me know, please comment down below. I think in Malaysia they sell like bigger bottles of these, but when I went to Malaysia I couldn't find it. So if you know, let me know. Oops! <laughs> Next one is apartment keys. Super needed. Next one is masks. We still use them here in the Philippines. And even if it's going to be normalized, that, you know. People don't have to wear masks anymore. I would still be wearing them because during the time that I wore them, I never had any form of cough or colds whenever I go outside. So this is going to stay in my bag, I think, until the end of time. <laughs> Next one is this brown tissue. Um, I like this better than the white ones. I get, like, my allergies get triggered if I use the white ones. These are recycled brown tissues and I love them. And that's it for today's video. I hope you liked it. I hope you found something that would be of use to you. Let me know in the comments below what you think about the contents of my bag and that's it. Thanks for watching. Bye.